Praise the Lord, my beloved ones. Today our Lord Jesus Christ has come with another prophetic word. And the Lord says that the last shall be the first and the first shall be the last. The Lord says that throughout your life you had been kept as the last. And as compared to your siblings and your friends and even in your neighborhood, you had been always lacking behind. It is because you are the child of the Most High and the Living God. The Satan always wants to attack you. However, in 2020, the Lord says no more of these attacks. The Satan shall not touch you, harass you anymore. And due to this, the Lord has come with his plan and purpose that the last shall be made the first and the first shall be made the last. However, this is not because the Lord is comparing you with your enemies. It is not because the Lord is comparing you with your siblings. It is not because the Lord is comparing you with your friends and neighborhood. It is only because it is the time of the Lord's plan and purpose in your life. It is the time of the Lord's glory to be manifested in your life. It is the time to show it to the world how great and mighty our Lord God has been. And you have been worshipping the Lord against all odds. You are the only one chosen in your family, says the Lord. So if you have been chosen, you have been made to prepare. You have been seeking the kingdom of God first. And during this process, your friends, your family members, your siblings have gone ahead in the materialistic blessings. However, the Lord says that it is time and this is the year to bless you with the materialistic blessings. And the Lord knows how to give you the leap in your blessings whether it is your marriage blessings, whether it is your promotion, whether it is your finances, bank balances, social honor, whether it is your friendship, whether it is your blessings in the relationships. The Lord says that in everything you shall be made first. You shall excel beyond the imagination of a normal mankind. The normal mindset of a human being shall be put into surprises, the Lord. And those who have been mocking on you shall be surprised at the Lord's glory upon you. Also, those who have been lacking behind in ministering the Lord, in preaching the gospel, in serving the Lord, because there was a long time for your preparation, because the higher the calling is, the longer is the preparation. So your blessings had been delayed only because the preparation time had been longer. The more you are prepared, the more you are perfected, the more you are corrected, is the more you receive the blessings after correction. The more you are corrected is the more closer you are in the promised land. The more you are corrected is the more perfectly you receive the reward in the promised land. So the Lord says that, because of this delay, now it is time for you to minister the Lord. It is the perfect time in this year, 2020. You shall see that you are moving ahead of all the other ministers because it is a long time that you had been seeking his presence. You had been praying for your ministry. You had been asking the Lord to grow your ministry. You are asking the Lord so that you can start the ministry. You are asking the Lord so that you can become a blessing for many. However, the Lord says the one who is last shall now become the first and you shall see a mighty change in your anointing. With the help of this anointing, says the Lord, you shall become first. You were earlier last and you were considered to be a wrongdoer. You were considered as a sinner. And the people of the world, they were putting all the shame, all the blame upon you. But it is time to show it to the world, exactly like the story of Joseph. Like the story of Joseph in Bible, you were the last and you shall find yourself glorifying the Lord, being used mightily for the kingdom of God. The Lord also says that in your marriage blessings, you are the one who is last. And this year, the Lord is going to bless you mightily so that you shall see yourself first. And 
you shall receive the blessings for your children's children you shall find the blessings going into your inheritance so that you shall see yourself in the first place along with your spouse along with your children along with the household blessings along with the social blessings along with the blessings that you have while you are serving the lord so in everything says the lord in your physical health you shall see yourself in the first place in everything you had been weaker the lord says but now in everything you shall be made strong you shall be exalted you shall fly up high like an eagle you shall receive the highest glory you shall receive the highest place you shall receive the highest faith so this is the time the moment and the year of the highest glory that you shall have the lord will exalt you to the greatest level of your lifetime and from this from this moment from this time says the lord that your time begins in the promised land you shall seek the lord more zealously after this and everyone shall be put to surprise everyone who had been mocking on you it is the time for them to see the lord's glory as well and seeing you the lord says that they shall also seek the lord zealously so those who were first they shall become last but even if they are last they shall come to the lord seeing you that you were last and you were made first in the family among your siblings you are the one who is the most weaker who is not been able to do anything good according to the materialistic blessings you did not get married you do not have job you are not earning well you do not have good health you do not have good relationships with anyone however the world does not know that you were focusing according to the plan and purpose you were seeking the kingdom of god and now since you have been faithful to the lord the lord says that it is time for the renewed blessings that shall be showered upon you so in the business you shall have abundant blessings and what they have been earning throughout the year you shall earn it within a month says the lord the lord says whatever they have been earning or making money or whatever blessings they have received throughout the year you shall receive it within a month in a month's time so that is the amazing glory that the lord has upon you because you were made last you were persecuted you were put to shame you were neglected you were called a burden as well you were called useless you were ignored to great extent but you always depended upon the lord for his glory you need the blessings and the lord says that the blessings are coming to you you knew that the lord will come to you one day and the lord says that this is the day this is the moment that you had been waiting for all the past shall be transformed into your future blessings whatever you have done the fasting the praying and whatever the seeking of the kingdom of god has come to you with amazing blessings whatever you have been doing for the kingdom of god the lord says that it's time for the reward my beloved ones if you have been led by the holy spirit to this prophetic channel then subscribe to it and press the notification bell icon to receive the daily prophetic anointing we thank all those who are honoring the lord with their wealth and for all the offerings we bless you with a hundredfold of return my beloved ones if you have not yet received our lord god jesus christ if you have not yet received the holy spirit we shall pray a small prayer because this repentance is at hand a father in heaven we come into your presence to our lord jesus christ and today we receive salvation we receive holy spirit into our heart oh lord forgive us our sins and help us to be born again we shall seek you oh lord jesus christ unto zion in jesus mighty name amen my beloved ones with the small prayer of repentance your sins are forgiven and you have received holy spirit within you you shall walk the walk of righteousness